Cha Cha's Kingdom. Today I want to show you how I made this smash cucumber salad. Actually, this is the only way my mom would make cucumber salad when I was a little girl. Why do we smash the cucumbers? Because when you smash it, you create this uneven surface, and it creates the surface area to absorb more sauce, therefore more flavor. But there's this one step. No matter what kind of cucumber salad that you make, this step. Makes the difference between an ordinary cucumber salad and an amazing one. Now let me show you what the step is and how I make our amazing smashed cucumber salad. But before I do that, if you like this video, please remember to like and subscribe. Thank you, and let's get started. <music> First, we're going to use the knife to smash the cucumbers until it breaks apart like this. Cut the tip off and then cut it into bite-sized length. If you can find these Japanese cucumbers that are a little longer, firmer, and more spiky, they're the best for this dish. If not, any cucumbers will do. And if some part of the cucumbers is still too big of a piece after you smash it, you can cut it into smaller pieces with your knife. Now, this step is my pet bowl. What we're going to do is to sprinkle with generous amount of salt, give it a good mix and a gentle massage, and then set it aside for 15 to 30 minutes. The process is called sha qing, which means you kill the raw. You use the salt to extract excess water out of the cucumber, so that the cucumber flavor is more intense, and also it gives the cucumber more room to absorb the delicious sauce that you make later on. Without the step, you're just coating the sauce on top of the cucumber. But if you do sha qing, then you're actually letting the cucumber absorb the flavor of the sauce, and it becomes part of the cucumber. Make sense? Let's continue. After 15 to 30 minutes, you'll see there's some liquid coming out of the cucumbers. We just need to discard all the liquid, and then we're ready to add in all the yummy seasonings. Now we also need to smash some garlic. Finely chop it or mince it, and then add in some light soy sauce, rice vinegar, and sugar. And you can stop here, or a lot of people like to spice it up with some chili sauce. You can get any chili oil or chili sauce that you can get from the supermarket, but I highly recommend you to try that the one I make, because I have tried the cheapest. One from the Godmother and the expensive one from the celebrity chef. From the oil to the crisp to the crunch, I am confident that you are gonna love my chili oil. From the moment you open the jar, you will be able to smell the difference. Okay, it's so aromatic, and the flavor will blow your mind. It's like, <laughs> seriously, if you don't love it, I seriously doubt that you're a foodie. I disqualify you as a foodie. I disqualify you as a fan of mine. Okay, don't watch me. I'm just joking. Please keep watching. <laughs> Anyways, if you want to give it a try, I'll include the link in the description box. Now, just mix it all up and let it sit in the fridge for at least 30 minutes. The longer it sits in the fridge, the more flavorful it gets. This smashed cucumber salad is very delicious and refreshing, and it's perfect for summertime. And it also keeps really well. So if you want, you can make a lot ahead of time and keep it in the fridge for up to a week. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you do, please remember to like and subscribe. Thank you, and I'll see you next time.